Happy Saturday, everybody. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Tops Gold Label Baseball, 16 box, pick your team number four. Very big thank you to everyone here who got into the action on a Saturday, night, Saturday the 19th, 2019. You have a little rooftop next to your name. That means you got that in a team random. And there's Ed, Last Spot Mojo, Phillies. Thanks to him. Thanks, everybody, for getting in. Appreciate it. And let's see what we have in this gold label. 16 gold framed autographs. Should be a lot of fun. All right, so we have four stacks of four right there. Good luck. Whoa! Eric Griebel saying sometimes more. He's seen a couple boxes with two inside. I'd be okay with that. Here's the here's the relic already. There's the frame. And Eric Antonitis is saying that he's also seen two autos in one box. I have not seen one of those yet. Well, hopefully, maybe we'll get lucky in this one. All right. Good luck, everybody. All card chip in this gold label. So you can try to build all the class one through three sort of stuff. That's out of 150. You want to build those sets. There's Fernando Tatis Jr., 11 to 50. Oh, and this Charlie Blackman will represent the teams that aren't on that don't have hits but have still have cards. So we didn't sell the Diamondbacks, Rockies, or Marlins, but that Charlie Blackman will represent a randomizer for those teams. Someone will get all of those. What well, Joe Loft has also seen a few with two. Hopefully we'll be that lucky. We have, whoa! I think that's the first gold nugget we've seen. That's awesome. Four out of five, Vlad Guerrero Jr. gold nugget. That's pretty awesome. That'll be for, who got the Blue Jays? Richard Zitterman with the Blue Jays. Got the Blue Jays straight up. Get a kind of a super zoom on this. How cool is that? Well, there you go. Richard, as you know, out of fives and under, Get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! It's a good way to start this break. Oh, we still have the frame, by the way. And it's Jeff McNeil. Nice rookie auto for the Mets. Then that will be for... That's also for Richard Zitterman, who got the Mets straight up. There you go. Personal box right there for Richard. Set these right here next to me. All right, 
so far so good. Yeah, I haven't seen one of those gold nugget. I know, I know they exist, but they're they're. I think they're they're pretty short printed. I didn't expect to see one, but man, lo and behold, one of the more desirable rookies too. Yes, <laughs> Jaspy Magic continues. What do those go for in a secondary market? Are people into it? All right, good luck. Okay, Bay, Blake Snell. Frank Thomas takes, uh, who does everyone have in this Astros uh, Yankees game? Frank Thomas takes the Yankees. Big Poppy takes the Astros. Let's see what A Rod takes. A Rod, Blavin. A Rod takes the Yankees. Big Poppy, only guy who took the Astros. There's Josh James, speaking of the Strohs. We might see him in action tonight. That'll be for Ravi and the Strohs. Eric G says Yanks. Astros fans should be worried. I think David Ortiz has not had a good prediction record. I don't think he's had a good prediction record uh, through the playoffs. A Rod, yeah, I know. A, a Rod may be contractually obligated to say Yankees. What's up, Gilo? So, a Vlad, wow, Jason Moyer saying a Vlad Nugget to 25 sold for 160. So, what would out of five would sell for a decent amount? That's not too bad. That should cover. That should cover the spot. Oh, did he really? I, I don't have the sound up too high. Ortiz just said himself that he's always wrong. I mean, yeah, Game 7 wouldn't be too bad, though. I know Nationals fans are like, yeah, keep, keep, keep this series going. There's Cody Ballinger for my Dodgers to 50. There's uh, Hideki Matsui to 99. All card chip in this too, ladies and gentlemen. So you'll get everything you see. All right. Vlad Guerrero Jr. And the gold frame is going to be Kevin Kramer. 16 out of 50 for the Buckos. Pittsburgh Pirates. Andy with that one. There you go. Andy L. Pittsburgh Pirates.
There's Buster Posey to 75. And the frame. It's Carter Keyboom, and the frame is going to be. Boom! A Brave, Colby Allard, a former Brave. This will still go to the Braves. That'll go to Eric Griebel with the Bravos. There you go, Eric. I think he made some pretty decent starts. I think I traded to Texas, right? I think he made some pretty decent starts with them. And a one of one, Trevor Story. Wow. All right. And remember, we didn't sell the Rockies, Marlins, or Diamondbacks. So we're going to randomize everybody's names. And the name on top will get any Rockies, Diamondbacks, and Marlins cards, including this one. So be the, there'll be a train whistle at the very end of the break. Good luck, everybody. And those cards, too. All right, behind Severino is going to be a giant. That's Steven Duggar. Rookie auto for San Francisco. Sanford got the Giants and the team random. All right. Maybe we'll find a, a, a two-frame box. That'd be cool. I feel like I'd feel it right away. Like there'd be just be a slightly different weight to it. I'm disappointed that you can't ride that train in in the in the Astros stadium here. Like I thought maybe in the off season they'd let people like take a ride on that train for like a few bucks or something like that. Part of a stadium tour or something. But apparently you cannot. As not for the public. Nor is the slide in uh in Miller Park, I think, where the Brewers play. Can't go down that slide. Unless you're the, the brewer guy. Splinter. Splendid. Rocket.
Mark McGuire, and we've got a Brewer, Corbin Burns. Dennis Genders with the Brew Crew. All right, batter up. Steve LeMayhew takes a strike, and we're underway. Strikes out DJ Mayhew. It's Keston Hira to 50. Also for the Brewers. Jason saying uh, those triple threads, the 10 player autos are going to be crazy. Yeah. Those books are really great. But it's usually, it's almost always one happy person and nine very sad people in the randomizer. Triple Threads pre-orders are available right now. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com Pre-order right now. Drops next Wednesday. Aaron Judge grounds out. And behind Jackie Robinson is a giant. Derek Rodriguez. Hudges kid. Relief, relief pitcher for the Giants right now. Sanford. Or starter? Relief, I think. Uh, maybe he'll get stretched out to a starter. Crowd is fired up. Fired up for Brad Peacock. Glaber Torres already down 0-2 in the count. And grounds out. Here's Luis Severino, 30 out of 50. It's a pretty efficient inning for Brad Peacock. Bryce to 150. It's Joey Gallo. And the frame goes to the Orioles. That's DJ Stewart. Rookie auto for Andrew. We got the Orioles in the team random. All right, now we are halfway through this break here. Good luck. How am I in the future? I, if anything, I thought it'd be lagging behind. Oh, Hulu. Oh, sorry. <laughs>
one day we'll get the we'll get the express written consent of Major League Baseball and be able to to have like the game in a window above my head or something. There's uh, Roberto Alomar to 150. Black Guerrero Jr., all cards ships, all those rookie cards will get to you. There's Austin Riley to 25 for the Braves. And the frame behind Shohei Otani will be Mitch Hanniger, 8 out of 50. Mitch Hanniger for the Mariners. Darren McKenzie with the M's. Got uh, Trey Turner, 75. Nationals waiting to see who they're going to face in the World Series. I think either team's going to be tough to beat, either AL team. Hey, Logan, what's going on? Bo Jackson. And we've got Andrew Benintendi. And the frame is for the Oakland A's, Ramon Laureano. Rookie autograph for Richard Zitterman and the Athletics. Ooh, Joe Loftus has, has an upset special for us. You have my Raiders beating Logan's Packers on Sunday. Upset of the week. Book it, he says. For entertainment purposes only, folks. I can't vouch for Joe Loftus. I don't know who he is, but personally, that is. Not financial advice. But I like where your head's at. Why, why do you think so? What's your, uh, what are your thoughts on why? Logan says Packers 31 to 10. Who's scoring those 31 points, Logan? Not Devontae Adams. Not... Parker? Adams? Yeah, there's no wide receivers for the Packers this week. Not Marquez Valdez. Scantling's not going to score those 31 points. 
Have you looked at the Raiders' run defense? Aaron Jones is not scoring 31 points. Bam, Jack Flaherty is your next gold frame. Although the Raiders did almost lose to Chase Daniels and the Bears in London two weeks ago. In the second, they almost blew in the second half, so who knows. Uh, Thomas R. got randomized to the Cardinals. Josh Jacobs is scoring three touchdowns this week, says Chris Rook. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> we have the weapons, says Logan. No, actually, you don't. That's the thing. You don't have the we weapons. If you guys had a he healthy squad, I'd be, I'd be worried. If you had Geronimo Allison and Devontae and you had Marquez Valdez-Scantling, and then I would be, then I'd be late. I'd be worried, too things you don't have the weapons but you do have Aaron Rodgers <laughs> out of 150 Ronald Acuna Jr. And there's Andrew Ben to 99. Raiders will have to run it though if they want if they have a lot of chance to win it. A lot. I try to control as much of that game as possible. For the Twins, Williams Astadio. Twins, Rookie Auto, going to Dominic. Picked up Minnesota. Final four boxes, folks. Did this feel heavier? No, I'm now I'm just, I'm just psyching myself out now. What are the, uh, does anyone know the rules on the net, on the netting that, that goes from foul pole to foul pole now? If it bounces off the net, if it hits a net, it's not in play? It's not, right? Or is it? If it hits a net, can you still catch it and be like, that's an out? I actually don't know the rule on that. I'm trying to think what happens when the when a catcher runs back. If it hits the net and it just kind of bounces down to you, still an out? If it hits the net, it's out of play. So you can't just wait for it to roll down the net and just grab it. Is that for all ball? I'm assuming that's for all ballparks. Never really thought of that. Like it's Chris Berry's just saying it's out of play. It's not like a. It's not like a, a hockey. Not like hockey. You guys can bounce it off the the boards. All right, there's Eloy Jimenez. And for the Blue Jays, Rowdy Tellez. Bluebirds, that goes to Richard Z. Joe Loftus, going back to the Raiders game, is thinking Raiders will stack the box against the run, which they've done okay with, pretty well with actually, stopping the run. 
since there's no real pass threat. Yeah, I guess like receiving threat for the Packers. And the Raiders have more weapons. Oh, the Raiders don't have Tyrell Williams. They're a little banged up too. So they have to go with Keelan Doss. But is this Trevor Davis revenge game? Hey Gary, what's going on? Out of seventy five, JT Real Muto. Jose Altuve to 50. All right, and Nice. Fernando Tatis Jr. Three. So we got the out of five, Vlad Guerrero Jr. Golden Nugget. The gold nugget piece. All right. Now we have Fernando Tatis Jr. autograph numbered to 50. And that's for Shusaku and the Padres. Nice. It's a pretty good break. Two boxes to go. Yeah, that was that blood nugget was pretty sick, right? It was definitely unexpected. All right. Twenty three out of fifty Cody Ballinger. Yeah, there is a train whistle Wayne at the end of the break too. Let's not forget about that. Part of that Rockies pile over there, the Brendan Rogers. All right, second to last frame. There's Calvin Jr. and the frame is Kyle Tucker. Rookie auto for the Astros. That'll be for Ravi. And the final box. Good luck, everybody. bomb just as Aaron Boone was having players warming up a pitcher warming up all 
All right, and the final gold frame is going to be for, it's another Kyle Tucker. This time, four out of 75. The previous one was not numbered. This one is numbered, and this one is another one for Ravi. All right, thanks, everybody. Very excellent break. And we have this one of one as well. So a train whistle to close things out. Out of fives and under. Get the old Big Hit Express train whistle. So let's fire up random.org. And let's see who ends up with that one of one. All right, let's roll it and randomize it four and a one. The name on top will get the one of one plus any of those other Rockies cards there as well. So good luck, everybody. Four and a one, five times. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five times, name on top is going to be... Den oh, there's no doubt about it, Dennis Genders. Top two spots for you, Dennis. That one of one among the other Rockies cards going to you. Trevor Story, one of one. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Pick your team four in the books. Thanks for watching, everybody. We will see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.